Okay, we're braze testing. We're brazing a small steel pin that is copper plated into a steel body. We're using a Dura Power 10 kilowatt power supply uh, for the testing, and we're running at about 25% uh, of power or 2.5 kilowatts on the machine. Uh, we've got a little bit of flux on the uh, on the component as we do not have an atmosphere system and what we're going to do is reflow the copper plating on the pin uh, to create the braze joint. Power is on now. Copper plating has flowed. Okay, the first test was run at two and a half kilowatts of power. This test will be run at three kilowatts of power. First test was about 10 seconds, uh, which would meet our production rates, but we're gonna see if we can do a little bit better. Power is on now. And braze has flowed. Okay, with this set of tests, we now have a silver braze ring mounted at the, uh, the bottom of the braze joint. We're going to continue running at 3 kilowatts of power. And the purpose of using the braze ring is to allow us to braze at a little bit lower temperatures, actually much lower temperatures. Um, and after the braze tests are done, we'll be sending the parts to the customer to do pull tests to see if they have the strength required uh, in the part. Power is on now. Silver has flowed and the part is brazed. on now. Part is braced.